my name is Kristen Gunderson. I'm in the Human Genetics program. I'm a third year student, so it's a two year program, but I'm part time. So um, this will be my last year coming up here. Um, I'm from Oregon, Wisconsin, which is a small town south of the capital, Madison. And I did my undergrad at Madison, Wisconsin uh, at the university. And I majored in human development and family studies. So in particular for Sarah Lawrence, it was the first genetic counseling program ever established. So there's like that really rich history there. Another aspect that really drew me into Sarah Lawrence is that it's affiliated with many different hospitals. So what we do is we do particular rotation sites. And with Sarah Lawrence, it's not just working with one hospital, but you kind of have a very diverse experience in going to many different hospitals within the New York, New Jersey, and Connecticut area. I think what Sarah Lawrence, the staff here, has worked with me and to kind of help me kind of grow into this person that I, I never knew kind of existed within me. And what they were allowed me to do is really kind of expand my role as not only as a potential genetic counselor, but just as an individual in general. They've really helped with my, my confidence. Um, I had the knowledge and I, I know it's there, but sometimes I, I struggle with talking to patients and I get very nervous. And so what they really allowed me to do is kind of look, look beyond my nervousness and kind of use that in helping patients. Um, additionally, the contacts here are fabulous and they're tremendous. And I will take these contacts with me for the rest of my life and carry them with me. Um, and the relationships that I formed with certain faculty members and then um, certain supervisors at rotations and then additionally, I'm doing a uh, internship with Stanford Hospital in Connecticut, and I work in a breast cancer risk assessment program. And so what I do is I calculate um, a woman's risk to develop breast cancer throughout her lifetime, and then I call her and talk to her about that risk and then what we can do in terms of risk-reducing strategies. So again, I, I don't think I would have been able to do that any, anywhere else but here. I think what Sarah Lawrence has and offers is you have the hard core science classes which really kind of resonate within those individuals that are very research based, very science based, very um, intellectual based, factual based. But also what Sarah Lawrence offers is that they offer this other perspective which I kind of more gravitated to, which was the more personal kind of human relationships and context and kind of fostering those strengths and those capabilities of talking to different patients and learning how you can um, take that information that you know and help someone A, educate them, but B, take that information and make a choice that's best for them. And so I think those individuals that apply to Sarah Lawrence are those that a, have the science background, but also those individuals that have, let's say, a theater background, and but are interested in talking to people. And so it doesn't have to be those people who graduated with a biochemistry degree or genetics degree. It can be anyone in any walk of life. It can be people who are in their 40s or in their 50s and are coming back and trying to find what they're passionate about. I think overall my experience has been a tremendous experience that I probably wouldn't have been able to receive anywhere else. And I'm just, I'm thankful that they gave me that opportunity to come here and to hopefully teach me how to be a great genetic counselor.